Wow, and just like that, we're back in Minnesota. Good old Minnesota. And you're probably like, yo, Tyler, what's going on? Why are you back in Minnesota? And the reason is because I'm actually coming up for a wedding. That is right. I'm going to be shooting a wedding. Pretty much, it's like a 10-person wedding. Uh, and it's just going to be really small. It's going to be at an Airbnb, like a house. And the wedding is going to take place in the backyard. But I'm still gonna be shooting the day and it's gonna be really enjoyable and I'm really excited to it. I'm back here, it's been really nice, it feels so good. Like I truly do love Minnesota. Summer is it's probably the best time, my favorite time to be out, especially because it's so green and because there's so much water. And I honestly, since being down in Arizona for four weeks, I did not realize how much I missed water and how much I miss green. Just like grass and trees and things like that. It's, Something I really didn't expect, but it's been fun so far. So we're basically gonna continue getting ready. One kind of crazy thing that did happen is that when we were coming from the apartment to the airport, I actually forgot my camera. And you're probably like, well, Tyler, you're shooting on a camera right now. Yeah, this is my point and shoot. This is like a $350 camera. Uh, my expensive wedding camera that I use is around $2,000. And that's what holds all my lenses. And I forgot that camera. And I was like, thugs. I'm like, do I go back, blah, 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 this and that. And I just decided on renting a camera, which is something you can do and I've actually done before. But it did get here in time and we're pretty much gonna go take a look at it now. So, you wanna come in the house with me? Sure, why not? Let's do it. Here we go. It says, release the happy. That's kind of funny. I like the comedic tape. So I rent from a company called Lens Rentals and every single lens or camera body that you get uh, comes in like a really hardcore case. Pops up, boom, look at that. And that's a return tracker. And then look, it comes in another case. Look at a case in a case, it's caseception. So this is the Sony a7 III. This is the camera I've been using for over a year now and uh, I really love it. One thing I really don't like is I personally do not like camera straps. I just despise them and I hate them. So uh, this is weird seeing one because on all my cameras, I take it off. This is kind of what I'm gonna be bringing along with the camera. I obviously I just showed, we'll start with the fun stuff. The first is gonna be this lens. This is my big bad boy. This is a 70 to 200, uh, this is the G series lens. This is the biggest bad boy camera of the day. I usually use this for ceremonies. Um, depending on how far away I am from this, I may just put it down to like 70 or 100, but uh, this is the first one, I guess you could say. The second one is gonna be this Sony 50 mil. It's a prime lens, which basically means that it doesn't zoom. It doesn't do the zoom zoom, it just stays in the same spot. Uh, but this is my pretty much like go-to one for the day. And then the other last, the lens that I'm bringing to bring is the Canon 24 mil. Uh, this is pretty much just a wide shot. So if I want to get like the whole scenery in it, um, so these are pretty much the lenses I use and will be using today. I will mostly probably use the 50 millimeter and the 70 to 200. In this little case is actually my drone. I usually use drones in every single one of my weddings, depending on weather and things like that. But this is the Mavic Air. It is extraordinarily tiny. I've had a lot of different drones and different variations of the trough spot, which is what I call my drones. If you haven't seen the first trough spot, I'll link the video right here. You can see that. It's actually one of my favorite videos I've ever produced. It's just a really fun video for me. These are pretty much lab mic recorders, which are very tiny and they just hook up to you so I can get audio footage of like the groom and the bride and the officiant talking and giving stories and things like that. This is the H4M Pro audio recorder, which this will help me record toasts and things like that better. And then pretty much for stabilizing things, I have a uh, Zion crane and I got this from Alex Tech, his good friend of mine. I don't know why, but this every time I use this thing, I think of Alex and I channel his inner amazing awesomeness. Uh, and if you don't know who Alex Tech is, I'll link his channel down below as well. He's a phenomenal filmmaker from Colorado and I had the privilege of working with him last year. So, but this is pretty much a small version of it, but it pretty much makes the camera smooth uh, and gets a lot of my handheld shots pretty steady. The last obvious thing I'm gonna be using is gonna be my uh, SD cards. This is one SD card, I have a lot, um, but my case is in my room and I don't really feel like it's necessary to show you all my memory cards because memory cards are kind of boring to look at because it's just a memory card. <laughs> but um, that's pretty much my equipment and so, 
I haven't really done a showing of the gear I use, so this is kind of cool to like let you get a little inside scoop of what I actually have to use. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. And I store everything in this backpack, which is amazing. I love it. Uh, the wedding is currently today on Saturday, June 20th, and it'll take me some time to edit it, but I'll definitely put it on this channel when I'm done so that you can view it and see what I actually created using all this equipment. That's kind of the fun part about it all. So without being said, I do appreciate you viewing and I have a lot more adventures to come. I've been doing some fun things while I've been here in Minnesota and obviously I'm gonna be spending some time on my longboard and uh, some time with friends and my mom. So you'll definitely have a lot more fun videos to see and check out in the future. So with that being said, as always, my name is Tyler Rossman. Thank you so very much for taking your time out of your day to watch. It does mean a lot and I'll catch you on the next adventure. Peace out from the living room. Watch out. Boom.